These are some of the strangest stories about VHS tapes. Remember those? In 2016, this guy was in trouble with the law for, get this, not returning a movie he rented 14 years before. The movie? Far from a classic. It was Freddy Got Fingered, starring Tom Green. And I was just borrowing one of your suits until I could get enough money to buy one of my own. James Myers says he was driving his daughter to school in North Carolina. I got pulled over for a bad brake light. Uh, they ran my driver's license. He did tell me you have a warrant from 2002 for a failure to return a VHS cassette tape from a video store, a local video store. I thought it was a joke. They handcuffed me, yes sir. They searched me, they took my belt, went through my wallet, patted me down. Actor Tom Green actually called James when he heard the story. We had a good laugh about it, and I think it's sort of a, an example of how, you know, bureaucracy can get out of control. As for James, all he could do was have a good laugh. <laughs> In 2021, this woman was a fugitive for failing to return a VHS tape of Sabrina the Teenage Witch starring Melissa Joan Hart. According to the warrant, Karen McBride did willfully, unlawfully, and feloniously embezzle a certain video cassette tape, Sabrina the Teenage Witch, of the value of $58.59. It comes with time in jail and huge fines, so it, it's serious. The tape was rented from a small VHS store in Oklahoma in 1999. Karen said she never realized there was a warrant out for her arrest. Me and my husband both uh, mouth dropped, and we I thought I was going to have a heart attack. She suspects the warrant followed her for two decades and affected her trying to get jobs. Uh, absolutely. I start the job, and then when they come back with the criminal background check, they'll let me go. Karen only learned about the warrant when she changed the name on her driver's license after getting married. She was then finally able to have her record fixed. Judge signed off, the DA signed off, and it had been expunged. To add insult to injury, she says it was an ex-roommate who she thinks rented the tape and never returned it. She says she never watched the TV show until the incident happened. No matter how late I'm running, no reversing the rotation of the earth. <laughs> Last night, I actually watched it. And I thought, okay, I'm 52. Maybe if I was 10. <laughs> An adorable 10-month-old boy takes his first baby steps. A priceless memory that was 25 years old. The forgotten video was discovered in 2020 by filmmaker Jim McKay when he purchased a VCR player at a Goodwill store. So who is that little boy in diapers? McKay launched his search by posting this video on his Facebook page. Please watch this video. I'll include an email address for contact in case you do recognize the name or the family. It went absolutely viral. The boy's mother saw the story on local news in Austin, Texas. And here's that little boy now. His name is Tyree Alexander. It was a challenge to him and, uh, and it was a mystery and he solved it. You know, he went Sherlock Holmes and he got it done. Tyree, an educator, had never seen the video before. It was amazing to see myself, you know, that small, uh, to see my big brother that small and, you know, all adorable and happy. And, uh, and, and to see my dad, you know, just loving on me and hugging me. Without Jim solving the mystery, the family treasure might have been lost forever. After I saw the video, I knew I had to make an effort to try to return it, to see if we could find the people. It's just a moment I would never have had he not sent it. He really blessed our family. It's a VHS tape mystery from 2018. This videotape was labeled a surprise, along with a creepy smiley face. A computer programmer had no clue what was on it when they found the tape at a thrift store. I just, you know, threw it in the bag of stuff I was buying just to see what it was. Intrigued, they purchased the tape and then recorded sticking it into a VCR machine at home. What comes up first? This very spooky static, similar to the horror film The Ring, where if you play a tape, you die in seven days. Seven days. <laughs> so what was on the tape? And I'm like, really? It's this? I'd say that was a very good joke. I'm amazed. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Andrea Swindle.